towards halfway. It's won by Montiel, gets the return ball, plays a 1-2 with uh, Wood and now plays it in behind to uh, Gibbs-White, inside right channel, held up just inside the box, turns in a circle to the edge of the box, lays it off for Yates, Yates down the line for Alanga, pulls it back, drive oh. is from Nico Dominguez, which hits, I think it was Varane, that might have been Kobe Mainu who's in there as well, and it spins away for a corner. Good start, Forrest. Oh, a great start. Gibbs White there in that familiar role, just lurking in front of the back four. Ahmad down the right hand side, linking up with Bruno Fernandes, who nutmegs Danilo. Squared back to the edge of the penalty area, and a pile driving first time shot from Dallo hits the post. Might have been a touch from Turner, but United still have it inside the penalty area until that's a good challenge from Dominguez on Juan Bissaka. That's the closest we've come to a goal for either side. Ten yards inside United territory. Good ball back to Alanga right side. He finds Montiel edge of the box, squares it back for Dominguez. Yeah! Yeah! The Morris corner. What a goal! Forest cut Manchester United apart with passing down their right hand side, and Nico Dominguez sweeps it home across the face of goal and low into the bottom corner and 63 minutes in at the city ground at the trench end Dominguez puts Forrest in front against Manchester United lovely passing football down that right flank Montiel with a ball in field and Nico Dominguez sweeps it home Forrest 1 Manchester United 0 as you said it was a real sweep he moved down that right hand so it was a fantastic little ball in and Dominguez with his first touch as you've seen on that right hand side oh no he's onside we're just looking at a replay Woods looked like he was offside but he's he's not it's not offside it's a goal sweet little ball in and what a beautiful, just a side foot across the path of the goalkeeper, giving him no chance whatsoever. Banana, absolutely frozen in goal, can't do anything. Fernandez takes the corner, high towards the back post, Garnacho volleys into the ground and it ends up on the roof of the net. It's a good corner, it was well met actually by Garnacho. he got decent contact on it, albeit into the uh, floor. And then it just looped up and away for a goal kick. Forest 1, Manchester United 0. Here at the city ground, Fernandez sends it long towards Rashford. Near Kate, his back goal side, sends it back to Turner. And Turner plays a pass out towards Danilo, but it's intercepted by Garnacho. Garnacho gives it to Rashford, who side puts it into the bottom corner of the net. And Manchester United are level. It's 1-1, you cannot give Manchester United the ball like that in your final third. And Garnacho intercepted the pass out and just rolled it to his left for Marcus Rashford. And Rashford hasn't got many this season, it's only his third goal of the season. But he wasn't going to miss and he tucked it low into the bottom corner. It's another one that will have to go down as a mistake by the goalkeeper Matt Turner as it was played back to him by Nia Kate, it just needed it, the boot put through it and it wasn't, it was a little pass into midfield that was intercepted by Garnacho just outside the penalty area and then he fed it to Rashford, 1-1 Forrest to make a change, their goal scorer Nico Dominguez is being replaced by Callum hudson Adoy. but it's one apiece at the City ground and Yates will pick it up Pretty sure that Garnacho was offside at the start of all of that, but now Forrest are breaking and it's four against four. Yates to the right hand side for Elanga. Elanga running at them towards the edge of the penalty area. Lays it off for Gibbs White. Yes! From the edge of the penalty area! Yeah! Right footed, low into the corner, beats Sonata at the trench end and stands in front of that trench end and takes the acclaim. Morgan Gibbs White with a belter of finish there's the fingers in the ears trademark celebration from Morgan Gibbs White and Forrest are in front again and once again it's fine passing down the right hand side rolled in field by Elanga who gets another assist and Gibbs White fires it in from the edge of the penalty area low to Anana's left Forest 2, Manchester United 1, 8 minutes to go.
Well, what a brilliant turnaround from a shot from Manchester United where Turner makes a save and Yates carries the ball from the 18-yard box. He's driving the ball a good 60, 70 yards to Alanga. Alanga sees Gibbs White on the edge of the 18-yard box. A lovely pass and I thought all he has to do is stroke the ball, hit the target. It was precise, it had pace, it was had a bend on it. It gave Inanna no chance whatsoever. He bent the ball around. Christian Eriksen to take the corner from the Manchester United left. He's played it out to Bruno Fernandes to volley from the edge of the penalty area. Oh, good save by Matt Turner on a uh, ricochet deflection from close range. And Turner turns it over his crossbar as it's spun up off the knees inside the penalty area. Bruno Fernandes met it well on the volley direct from the corner and then it hit, I think, Yates and possibly Murillo. United have it down their left-hand side. Ball drifted across towards the right-hand side. Now, this is Ahmad Diallo cutting into the penalty area. Shoots low, straight at Turner. Makes no mistake, down low by his near post. And more pressure seconds are eaten up. We're almost seven and a half minutes into added time. Yates wins the tackle again in midfield, breaks for Bruno Fernandes, he gives it to Garnacho. Garnacho carries it forward towards the edge of the box, plays it outside him for the cross to come in, comes back post for Diallo, nods it down for Eriksen, and Eriksen shoots wide. From ten yards yes. out, and that's it! The referee blows his whistle, and Forrest, for the first time since 1992, have beaten Manchester United on their own pitch here at the city ground and they've followed up victory against Newcastle on Boxing Day with victory against Manchester United in their final game of 2023 to move themselves five points clear of the Premier League relegation zone and claim a second win out of three games under the new head coach, Nuno Espirito Santo.